but I was still able to do it. I just messed up my jump because of, you know, platform. Five. I'm <laughs> being a goofball. Yeah, I'll do it. I've been there. Yeah. You fucks. Gotcha. Nice. In there. Jump grab. Ooh. Nice. Ooh. Nice. All right. Boom. No, I want a big frown. Big frown. <laughs> Yeah, I think the English community doesn't have the U in Kaizo, it's just Kaizo with an O at the end, so, yeah. Bastard. Hey guys, Joe. I decided to make a level that's, for once, not crazy Kaizo tricks everywhere. I wanted to make an easier level, and I also really just wanted to use the flying squirrel skin since back when the game first came out, and I actually, you know, I played it a little bit at the time of release, it didn't have that skin, so I thought I'd try to play as it, and from what I've heard, a lot of people don't really care for it, but so I, I wanted to make a little level play around with that. Unlike my other ones, it's, yeah, it's fairly easy and, I think, fun. So, uh, yeah, here's me making that level. Actually, we're going to go to Horse Robot again. Atarashi Koso Tsukute. And then, I do want another Flying Squirrel level. So, Mario Bros. U. It's still sixty dollars because of Nintendo. Yeah. Here, you want me to um get over there? Let me see. Let me see. Show my credit card on stream really quick. I'll take my cloud. And this will be good just to test it. This isn't gonna be the actual thing. It's just a test. We're just testing stuff out. Testing the water. It should land around. Dude, this is really fire. This is a good version of this. Up there. Can we check it? Alright, ready? Dude, that hit off the wall? Dude, this might be sick. This might be nasty, dude. Check this out consistent. Boom. Okay. Bye. Bye. Watch that again. We jump, we hit here. This is where we use our form. Or our R here. R. I mean, you figured that out, and you never played a game, so that's good. If you can figure that out, then people who have played the game actively will know. God, what a god he is. That's jank. <laughs> That's jank. Let's let's make it a little longer. So I think if you're falling, let's see if you're falling. If you're falling, can you pick up the show? Let's do the level up, you know? You're just doing whatever you feel. You can catch it while you're falling. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I love 
song. This might be cool. I don't want that. That seems a little too tiny too. Although I never usually die there, it seems annoying. Hmm. What if I'm right here? Could I hit that shell? If I'm paying attention to that coin, hit that coin, will that shell hit under my feet every time? Not when there's a goddamn spike there, Joe. That's it, I'm done with that. I definitely want people to understand what they're doing. Tell them to stick here. Arrow. Easy. I don't know if that's that obvious, though. Should work. We'll try it out anyway, just in case. Yeah, that's fine. Better than fine. Oh wow, that took a long time. Uh, let's get out of here. Let's get this out of here. Low view over a little bit. Well, that was fine too, actually, but let, let's just see how it goes. Seen this because you don't need it. You know what can be fun is speed running the level. You know, that's where the tightness should come in in the timing. I don't want people to beat it too, like, you know, I don't want people to get annoyed because they can't beat it and they die, like, when there's like 0.1 second left that they need, but they just don't have it and they die at the end. Like, that's boring. If they get the tricks right, they deserve to win. If they get everything right, if they get through the level, they deserve to win. But I do want them to have some indication that it's it's a running level. Like, if well, if run doesn't do it, I don't know what will. So maybe not. Oh, I forgot to hold the um. I forgot to let go the button. Now I just need to think of something else that's cool for later. But yeah, I think. I think, um, alright Joe, you really gotta stop missing that. This is, this is cool. I like this, how you throw this. It's a little tight, but as long as you just throw it as soon as you grab it, you'll be all set. And then you flutter down, or not even flutter down, you stick onto this wall here. Stick onto the wall. And as long as they figure out you can stick onto the wall, I think, I think you're safe. Just stick onto the wall and you're, you're golden. Like that. If you, if you know how to do that, you're good. Fly. Kick, bounce, fly. That's good, dude. That's really good. I like that a lot. All right. All right. See, we're getting somewhere. This is awesome. There's a few differences, but a lot of differences people didn't like, myself included. There was a lot of things that they took away. Um, they took away mid errors, which I loved. They took away um, spin grabs, which was a huge no-no, man. Everyone loves spin grabs. It was a huge piece of tech in a lot of the um, levels, so a lot of people hated that chain. Now what a spin grab is, is you know in Mario games how you have this spin jump right here? See how I spin when I jump? Well in um, 
This game, you can't grab things while you're spinning. In the first game, you can actually spin and grab stuff. Like, you can be spinning and have a shell in your hand. You can't do that now. You can't. Like, if I try to jump and grab, it just knocks off my head. So you cannot spin jump anymore. And people hated that. I'm not going to lie. I thought it was a bad idea, too. I don't know why they took that out. But, yeah, they did. And people really, really hated that. Damn. I wish... I wish I was playing Super Mario Sunshine right now. Because I actually love Sunshine. I think I just love those types of 3D Mario games. I love Galaxy. I love all of them. Alright, alright. Let's see what we can do here. Let's see what we can do here. You know what I actually thought was really underrated? And I guess that didn't even get that many good sales. Or that many sales. Is the Wii U. I love the Wii U so much, dude. And I guess it was like... A flop like I guess they considered it like a really bad like it wasn't really a great system which I don't get because I love the Wii U it was awesome dude they had great games on the Wii U wow nice just in time for the headshot love that um Yeah, I haven't heard of it yet, but yeah, that sounds cool. What's it called, do you know? Hey, can you look it up real quick? Nice. Not nice. Okay. Alright then, alright. All I played on PC was VR chat. There we go. There's the kick. Now, will it happen consistently? I doubt it. But let's see. Let's see. All going good so far. Hit that. Jump off. We're going. We're going. We're going. We're moving. We're moving. We're flying. We're flying. Okay. Okay. Now, what is that shell going to do? As far as I'm concerned, absolutely nothing. Alright, yep, it most certainly does. Um, mm, okay, spikes have it your way. No. Um, we're gonna have. You already know what we're gonna have, boy. We're gonna have the setup. We're gonna have the same setup we used three times because I'm so so goddamn lame. Yeah, I'm not getting very creative. I'm trying, but let me let me see what happens here if I do this. Can you not die, you bastard? Get down here. Don't die this time. Let's try it. Let's just try it. Wait a second. That's a good one. Ah, oh, that was so cool. Okay, so that's not a hundred percent accurate. I need to make it a little a little shorter, maybe. A dispute on who owned it. Let's just move this forward, right? And have the gate. Have this like this, right? Have this bigger. And have a one way gate. It seems a little lame, but I think it's the way to go. And have a. Another one way here. Would that be fair? I think that's fair. I think I don't think that's too easy. I think that's fair. 
like. I, I just don't want this to be lame, man. I want it to be accurate. I want it to be consistent. I want it to be fun. I'm putting in a lot of effort and time into trying to make these indications make sense. Dude, that's my favorite. Joe, you're so dumb. <laughs> ah, I didn't even think about that. I'm so stupid, dude. Okay, okay. It's a dude, I love that part so much. Oh my god. He's hype, he's hype. Wait, wait, wait. Then, yeah, we're, we're off. We're off to the races, boy. Oh, yeah, we're off to the lava. What am I thinking, dude? You can't do that. <laughs> am I nuts? Yeah, you can't. You can't do that. <laughs> You're in the lava if you do that. <laughs> here, here, here. Let's, let's do this. Let's do this. Otherwise, oh my god, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's not go in the lava here. Let's, let's... We'll turn here, right? And then we'll... We're, we're going this way, going this way, going this way. Now we hit the, the jump, the big boy jump. Right here is what I'm thinking. The hardest part for me... I think personally the hardest part would for anyone would be this right here the timing of this that's it if you could do that you're fine if you could get past this part you're fine everything else is so free so fun look at that it all just falls into place look how free this is then boom yeah, that works out. That works. Yeah, I have no idea how I missed that one time. That was weird. Look at that. Free. Love it, dude. looks fun I felt I feel like it's kind of fun it's I, I think I just really wanted to use the flying squirrel like really badly she would not go much to the side lava flight simulator it is bro I can't think of anything any better name than this close no sets me on New York stick to the side um that's fair nut flyer Name it cock nose. Cock nose. It's not even clever. Nut flyer. Nut flyer can be good. 